Hello, love and peace to all of you and to all of your loved ones. Okay, but I want to do a quick video. Tomorrow I'm going to do a video about 2019. So please watch that one because I think it's important. Um, we're in a big time, arguably the biggest moment in human history. Um, anyways, that's for tomorrow. So for today, I just wanted to give you a good story, a nice happy ending story. And show this will show you that spiritual practice works. Spiritual practice really does pay off. You know, we just think money, you know, hard work. Um, there's even a rap song from Ice-T, Crime Pays. Or, you know, we think just material. We're always so material, not just physical actions, but money and such. Spirituality pays off. So I can't, went to India, had a great time. You know, the the warmth, had the warmth of the villagers and all this, like, meditating a lot. So, um, going to quiet places. And then when I came back, I felt like my parents um, immediately unloaded, like, six months of panic on me. Like, they were thinking about, you know, how I'm such a, like, wild yogi type, and, you know, and to them and worrying about you know you're not getting a career together and you know blah 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 and I felt like they didn't even want me there at first and so I got overwhelmed you know um, mainly because of them you know I felt like whoa but you know taking the teachings of spiritual teachings and meditation you know, that's the moment, that's what meditation and spiritual practice is for. And so I thought, well, everything's my reflection. And if I want to change from them, I need to change. So like an Aikido move. Well, I didn't, I didn't put, I didn't reflect back their panic to them, but I converted, I transmuted that energy and just, well, absorbed it. I kept my heart open. I didn't panic and push back and resist. And so then I just kept my heart open and just whatever and just was looking at them with love as opposed to a fear, right, in, in a way. And I'm not kidding. I was not expecting this. It was quite shocking that the instant I did that, my parents changed. It was really amazing because it's something that even I would never have expected. Um... And, you know, they don't exactly know why they, or whatever. Maybe in their mind they were thinking something like, oh, I'm over panicking or, or telling him things, and they stopped. But bottom line was they stopped, and then the vibe completely changed. I don't care what the reason is, but all I know is as soon as I changed the way I was reacting, they changed. And then it gets even better. Um on Christmas, then I took this, you know, and we were, things were going well, things weren't bad, you know, at that point, but then it got even better at Christmas, and this is something I've been trying to do for years, on Christmas, as I was driving home with my mom and dad, I was talking to my mom, and I was just putting it bluntly, which I've done in the past, like, mom, like, you need to stop, you know, putting people, putting people in the family down and please just don't try not to um, just try not to hurt people you know that love you and I've and it was quite amazing like she actually listened and um, I told her like you know I know you're soft on the inside but you're spiky on the outside like a cactus and she really listened. She even then a couple of days later, she opened up to me and was crying about her past, crying about her, her sister and how it was really hard for her and stuff like that. So it was quite a beautiful thing. It was the most um, beautiful Christmas present I could have ever gotten. <laughs> so 
I just wanted to share that because it's a good ending and it just shows you that spirituality works because this has been years though this has been years of me clearing my own crap and I feel like I never would have forget energetically and spiritually which I think was a big part of it but even if you don't believe in any of that just the fact that I was able to receive to in my mind receive her panic and receive my dad's panic and and fear and projections and just not react that alone you know allowed this to happen um and to not react with anger right it's so easy for us it's a habit they parents push on you uh, well they they throw something on you and you just push away you push against you know but this took a long time i had to clear myself before i could get to a level to where i wouldn't need to react to my parents um you know i'm not perfect but i'm so much better and it's it's i'm really happy to say the teachings that i used to teach um i don't i don't i don't like to say i'm a teacher but i have a teacher vibe in me sort of naturally but just the things i like to share and and wanting to help that's really all it is me wanting to help others i'm happy to say that it worked it completely worked for me i cleared myself and then i was able to change myself and then guess what from changing myself i changed my loved ones so that was the happy ending i wanted to tell you guys it's spirituality pays off clearing your issues clearing your karma whatever you want to call it it pays off and uh, it takes work though and it takes courage and um it takes humbling and so there you go it's not just woo woo it actually works at least it worked in my on my end sure just to be super thorough i'll throw this in there and this is maybe a downer but just because i want to be honest everyone has different karma so some people have a lot more to clear so you know but anyway the more you clear your issues in your past the more you're going to have a positive future you actually at least at least allowing it the possibility is much more possible if you clear your past and having gratitude for the future like i had in the post gratitude is gratitude means you're already received so you should always have gratitude and then you're letting the world universe know okay time to give him or her something anyways it worked for me it could work for you